Hey guys, welcome back to Reembok Reacts. For those of you that are new to this channel, I do some reactions, commentary and reviews, and the occasional shoe reviews on all kinds of TV shows, uh, movies, and whatever your requests may be. So make sure you hit the like, subscribe, and notification button, and make sure you comment below of some different things that you'd like to see. So we are on to episode seven. Oh my God, you guys, The Last of Us is so compelling. It is absolutely an emotional roller coaster ride. I am falling in love with this show. I'm not much of a video game person, but I absolutely love this and I might find myself trying out the video game. But anyways, I'm not going to be doing that until we complete this entire season at least um, because I want to bring to you some authentic reactions. I do not watch the trailers. I don't want read any information about what's happening. So everything is just learning on the go and trying to kind of unravel the story and what's going on and at the moment we ended with Joel being stabbed by this mob on their way to get Ellie to um, the university where she needed to get to the base so that she could help with providing a vaccine he fell off the horse as they went to the place and it was totally deserted and there was I don't know just a, a mob of of um, people running around and that's another thing with the story they're not only at war with the infected and trying to end this epidemic pandemic this infection worldwide infection that has pretty much ended the world um, they're also fighting against each other uh, just because trust is a huge problem the military even turned against its own country and its own people um, there's not enough resources to go around so there's just kind of everywhere there's betrayal, it's just survival of the fittest, and these different gangs have formed. You know, you have the military, Fedora, you have, sorry, you have the military, Fedra, you've got the militia, um, which is Kathleen's group, who are rising up against the Fedra, and you also have the Fireflies, who are also against the Fedra, but they're really working hard to find a solution to this problem. And then you just have kind of small little, I guess, pockets of gangs everywhere where people have just kind of um, outskirted themselves and just trying to survive. So let's see what happens. I'm really, really itching to find out what happened to Joel. He cannot be dead. Like, honestly, like this is, no, that's not right. Um, Ellie can't go on without him right now. Okay, let's get started, you guys. Where are we? We're in a neighborhood. We're not where we left off. Where Ellie was begging Joel to just wake up. And it was quite the heart-wrenching scene. Totally had me in tears. Mm, some eerie music. Already I have goosebumps, you guys! Ah. Okay. Horsey. I love horses. Whose horsey is this? Ellie, Ellie, yes! Okay! <gasps> Joel's awake! Joel's awake! Ah! He's in pain. Why? Yeah! Yeah! Shut up, Joel. No. No. Oh, she's strong. How'd she get him there? He's trying to get her to go back to Tommy. She does not want to be abandoned herself. So I think this is very hard for her. If she has to leave to go get help, what is she going to do? She would never abandon him. She just, she can't. That's something she doesn't want to happen to her. <gasps> what in the world is going on? 
Ah! Ellie's backstory! Where are we? We're in probably the Fedra training camps. Oh! Reminds me of Police Academy. Hey! That's right. <laughs> She's in the principal's office. Of course, he has to be Asian. Strict. Commander. You've never been what I call well behaved in the last few weeks. Huh. Bethany started it. Well, Bethany's in the infirmary with 15 stitches. Good. Okay. Just put me in the fucking hole. I put you in the hole three times. It doesn't work. <laughs> so I'm going to try something new. What? Mm. I'm going to tell you the truth. Mm. You're smart, Ellie. You're so smart. You're stupid. Can't see where this is going? Let me help you out. Two paths ahead of you. First path. You keep acting like a grunt so you get the life of a grunt. Up at dawn, walk the streets, walk the wall. You eat shit food, you do shit jobs, you take shit orders from your patrol leader, who'll probably be Bethany. Mm. And that'll be your life from now until you catch a bullet from a firefly or fall drunk off a roof or get your hair caught in a moving tank tread. Mm. What? Get your hair it's caught in a moving transfer. You follow the rules, you become an officer. Mm -hmm. You get your own room, you get a nice bed. We eat well, we don't go on patrol. We're cool in the summer, we're warm in the winter. And best of all, when you're an officer, you get to tell the Bethany's of the world exactly where to shove it. <laughs> Why do you even care? Yeah. I care because no matter what anyone out there says or thinks, we're the only thing holding this all together. If we go down, the people in this zone will starve or murder each other. That much I know. There's a leader in you. And one day it could be your turn. Or not. So which way? Jeez. Good. Good choice. So there's a gray area. That's it. Pedro's crazy bad. Pedro's not all good and innocent. <laughs> good old Walkman. With the tape. Good times. Hmm. She reads a lot. A lot. That's probably why she's smarter. <sighs> Comic book she was reading with, um, Sam. Teenager with a lot of energy. Hormones flying. Can't sleep. Don't want to be told what to do. Discipline. Oh. 
Oh. Well, who's in there? Oh yeah, I remember Marlene mentioning Riley. I joined the Firefly. Oh, fuck oh. you. I'm not in the mood for this, Riley. I'm really not in the mood. Hmm. You're a Firefly? Jesus. I told you I'd fucking do it. Talking about liberating the QC is not the same as... Fuck, where did you... Slow been? down, slow down. I will tell you everything. First, you have to promise me something. Sort of crazy, and you're gonna say no, but then you have to say yes. Okay. No choice. Come with me for a few hours and have the best night of your life. No. Okay, now say yes. I'm not going anywhere with you. It's great, it's 2 a.m., and in a few hours I have drills where we learn to kill fireflies. Get dressed. <laughs> Turn around. You're so weird about that. Hey, it's fine. <laughs> if you're thinking about hanging in the park, we can't go there anymore. It's a new patrol that they just put in. Well, we're not going to the park. Okay. So where are we going? Secret. Trust me. You trust me, right? I don't know. Should I trust you? Of course you should. With your life. <laughs> no. Straight up. Best friends for life. Gus? No. Gus Fletcher's fucking stupid. Ready? This <laughs> better be good. Okay. Situation. No thanks. I'd like to keep my other eyebrow in one piece. Mm. Well, since you're so interested in self preservation all of a sudden, maybe you should stop fucking with Bethany. What's that about? Nothing is stupid. She has to get 15 stitches. Maybe you shouldn't mess with people like that. I'm sorry, are you, are you telling me not to beat people up? <laughs> you put Carol in the infirmary for a fucking week. I'm just saying, you can't fight everything and everyone. You can pick and choose what's important. Oh. Are they teaching you this at Firefly University? Kinda. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And fuck Carol. Uh -huh. Fuck Carol. Fuck you, Carol. Where are we going? Through a damn window. <laughs> oh, when are these infected gonna randomly show up? They can like break it's through the friggin' road and underground too. Anarchists. 
attitude. Makes sense. Uh, one side government rule, one rule, and anarchist yeah. people rule. Is, is this the big surprise? No. No, this, this guy wasn't here yesterday. Oh. Oh my god. Is he about to turn or what? This isn't moonshine either. It's like from before. This guy must have spent every card he had to get this. No one told him he couldn't mix pills with that shit. I think he knew what he was doing. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> what? Jeez. Yeah. Uh huh. Give me. Oh, okay. <laughs> Bad girls. It's great. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Foreshadowing? She's handled a gun before, so it's obviously during this well, time. What happens? Really? <laughs> really, why? I feel like it's gonna be a sad story again, you guys. I can't take this. Okay, it's too um, much heart wrench. <laughs> Heartbreak. I got bored, so I stuck out. I was on my way back. And this chick popped out of nowhere. Chick like our age? No, like 40 or 50. Whatever, anyways, old. She said she was impressed watching me sneak around, uh -huh. avoiding guards. And she asked what I thought about Thedra. So I told her the truth. They're fascist dick bags, and they're the ones that should be getting hanged for their crimes. They're fascists? She's like, all right, if you want in, you're in. That's it? You were initiations? Nope. I said yes, and now I'm a firefly. That easy to give up everything, huh? By everything, you mean becoming a fascist digbag? I mean, I don't know if it's that simple. But in a way, Fedra kind of holds everything together. You know, as much as I love our- That gray area. We're on a mission here. So she thinks Fedra themselves are fascists, huh? Okay. <laughs> Skipping rooftops. Ah, so Fedra's not entirely back. 
Fascist dick bags, starving their own population. Uh, fireflies blowing up the story sequel didn't help. Propaganda bullshit. Yeah? So you don't bomb stuff anymore? Propaganda. No, civilians are around. That's propaganda bullshit. Mm. What? One. It's okay you don't know everything. I agree <laughs> disagree. And two. Right here. Ugh. It's sealed off, then why isn't it sealed off? What do you mean? Oh, don't go looking for trouble. You bad kids. Oh, come on. Just have to create so much suspense for me. Why? Does she know? So turn right, open the door, tell me when you're there. Go. Fine. Are you gonna kill me? She was supposed to say open the door, turn right. <laughs> Messed up her lines. in there. Oh! Shopping! Yeah, me too. I would be totally hypnotized. So. Shopping. I love shopping. Seen those hey. Escalator. Go no, 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 no. No. Good choice of music. She is kind of fearless. First time on escalators, it's kind of pretty daunting. They like got unbalanced and stuff. shut it down so the stuff that's gone is the stuff that people need it the most or want it I guess 
Right, so sneakers. Mm. And not so. <laughs> I would go for the sneakers. I, mean, I don't get why people back then wanted all this stuff. Do you need me to explain it to you? Ha ha, no. I know why. It just. Materialistic world? Yeah. <laughs> Lodge me. Oh Nothing, my god. I was just trying to imagine you wearing this. <laughs> <laughs> this is too funny. <laughs> Staring at lingerie, wondering what the hell is a matter with you people. Ellie. Uh -huh, I'm on my way. Something's gonna pop out. Nope. I was waiting for it. The gap. Let's check right here. Close your eyes. What for? Close. Do you trust me? With my life, apparently. Oh, well then give me your hand. Come on. Almost there. Now? Almost. I said almost. Mm -hmm. Okay. Open your eyes. Carousel. Shit. <laughs> Oh, the simple things. You wouldn't know you would miss. What? <laughs> Nothing. I haven't been on a carousel in a long time. No. Yeah, not yet. Give me a <laughs> <laughs> Booze it up. Here we go. Gonna make you drop your guard. How are you gonna stay alert? Bad decisions. I would imagine you have to be on alert at all times. <laughs> Especially going out out of the quarantine area. Some type of fantasy, Ellie. They've done it in the other QZs. Set things right the way they used to be. Yeah, we could do that too. If you come back, I mean, we're we're like the future. You know, we could make things better. We could be running things. You could be running things. I turn 17 next month. That's when you get your assignment. You know what Kwan gave me? Sewage detail. Oh, Standing guard while people shovel shit. That's what they think of me. Oh. Oh. Why didn't you tell me any of this? It's her reason for leaving. I, don't know. I I just I panicked. And I ran. And 
The longer I was away, the harder it was for me to come back. Mm. Is that making sense? No, I get it. Mm. I would have gotten it back then too, you know? <laughs> Standing you guard on Swoosh. one too. thing I miss from that fucking place. <laughs> if that makes a difference. <laughs> Okay, come on, guys. You know what? We're two unders down. Three more to go. If you want to keep going. I mean, I want a magic chorus with like a million lights. I don't know how it's supposed to get better. <laughs> oh. <sighs> what is it? Is that a time machine? Come on. <laughs> Time machine. Arcade. Right? No, not the arcade. It's a photo booth. Oh, look at that. I can't prepare. Have you done this before? No, idiot. I was waiting to do it with you. There must be a... What is it called? Pladium or something over there? That'd be kind of cool. Print it for real? Wow. Go. It's been like 20 years. Oh, fuck. Nah, I didn't. Not enough ink. That one's not bad. Mm. Hmm. Do you like it? Do What is it? Ah, oh, I knew it. See, there had to be a Palladium Raja's arcade. <laughs> Raja. <laughs> this is hilarious. It's got to be a theater there too. How would you turn that? The film on and stuff, right? Okay. Ah, ping pong. Ah, uh, no, no. Shoot, what is it called? Ah. The ball one where you shoot the ball. I forget what it's called. Yes. However, Mario Kart. If they have a Mario Kart one, that would be good. That's like NASCAR or something. You still got- Ha ha ha! What the hell? It needs coins. And there's still coins over there? Oh my god. Coins mean nothing, hey? Anymore. Money means nothing. Just like that, it's all gone to shit. <laughs> Mortal Kombat! Yeah. Luke Kang. <laughs> Rated. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah, Johnny Cage. Who does she have? Oh, Scorpion? Yeah, Raiden and the other. Who's that? Chun Li? No. 
No, that's Street Fighter. I keep saying Chun Li, and I didn't mean her. I mean uh, Sonia. Sonia. Yeah. <laughs> Fight. <laughs> Finish him! Yeah! The finishing move! Kiss of death! Yeah, Melina! Who's Melina? Uh, she ate him up and spit him out. Spit out the bones. Oh! Alone? Alone? <laughs> Whoa, don't tell me. Lurking in the dark somewhere. Oh my god. No! Oh my god! I can't take this! Oh! Oh! Yeah. Oh my god. Computer get drunk. It takes screenshots. What are screenshots? I don't actually know. Okay. <laughs> okay, 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 I get it, I get it. <laughs> oh, here we go. What do you call an alligator in a vest? Huh. Did you make these? Yes, Ellie, put it down. See who soldiers? Hmm. You didn't find this mall, did you? They posted you here. You recruit guarding their stash? We would never use them on you or anywhere ever near you. I would never let them do that. You would never let them? But right. they will. You think they're gonna listen to you? Yeah.
I mean, I guess we'll find out. Ellie. It's okay, I'm going. Ellie. 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 None of this shit was even about me. Would you stop? Fuck you. Ellie. Ellie, I'm leaving. They're sending me to a post in the Atlantic QC. I asked if you could join so we could go together. But Marlene said no. Who the fuck is Marlene? Marlene is the lady that helped me get... It doesn't matter. Ellie, I tried. Tonight's my last night in Boston. Oh, her friend's leaving her now. Why did you bring me here? Because I wanted to see you. And? I wanted to say goodbye. Hmm. This isn't easy, Ellie. It actually is. You just did it. Hmm. Goodbye. Oh, the lights are off. Weren't they just on? <gasps> Riley! <laughs> Riley! <laughs> what the fuck? <sighs> Surprise. Huh! So I guess she wanted her to come with her. So you leave me. Mm hmm I think you're dead. All of a sudden you're alive. And you give me this night. This amazing fucking night. And now you're leaving again. Forever. To join some cause I don't even think you understand. Tell me I'm wrong. I think that you don't know everything. She said that before. You don't know what it was like to have a family to belong. I mean, I didn't have them for long, but I had them. I belong to them. And I want that again. Maybe the fireflies aren't what I think they are, but they chose me matter to them you matter to me first everyone's trying to find belonging and love god damn it i'm gonna punch you so mm. bad mm. <laughs> that's love it makes you hate me less <laughs> at least kind of love oh sure about this about leaving <laughs> she 
too sure. She was never planning on running away. She was well, going to stay with the Fedra. Nate's not over yet. One last thing. <laughs> she's she's going to be tired tomorrow. Oof. Get ready to run. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. Live freaking fast. That, that that's not how they die. You gotta get him. Like in the neck. <gasps> oh friggin' hell. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. There you go. There you go. Just one? Is there more? Holy shit. Oh. 
went up against one. What's wrong? Oh. No, 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 no! Oh, she's bad. Well, we all know how that's gonna end. No, she's not gonna let him die. Shh, nope. No, it's no. Two minutes or two days. We don't give that up. I don't want to give that up. So, yeah, but once you turn, I then. Just feel poetic and shit and lose our minds together. What's option three? What is she looking for? Oh, I knew it. Burn the needle. I guess not. Did she learn the stitches? She's gonna stitch them up. <laughs> Oh, that's gonna hurt. Shit. Oh. Oh. Oh, 
gosh, he's so sorry. I have a hell of poor Joel. He's gonna pass out. It's too much pain. Ugh. Oh, freaking fuck. Why does it always have to end like that? Oh. Okay, you guys. Now I've ended the episode with tears. So I'm going to be talking to you with tears in my eyes. Okay. So. Oh. You guys, the hands, they were holding, he held her hand. So, Ellie would not abandon him, never. She ended up having to obviously abandon her friend, Riley. Riley got bit, she, get, she got bit, obviously she has antibodies, so she didn't get sick, but Riley would have turned, so. What does that mean? Hmm. I think she wouldn't let her friend be one of those infected for the rest of her, you know, like, afterlife, so. I bet she had to take her life. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Wow, guys. Thanks for joining me for this one, and I'm now itching even more <laughs> to see the next one. Let's see what happens. They always have to close off that story. Joel's getting stitched up. What next? Holy freaking craziness. I'm just so drawn into that. All right. Make sure you guys like and subscribe and hit the notification button. And we'll see you next time for the next episode. Take care, guys.